That is staying. That is staying in. Yeah. Hi. Hi, welcome to the Weekly Bit. Hello. We, we harmonized again. I just FYI. I was gonna say something, Fui. but I decided not to Fui. because I always comment on it. Good. So uh, we've returned to form. A la bitch jar. Um, some bitches. Um, so yeah, I think I pulled it out last time. So you go, go, go. Yeah. I mean, we could talk about this one. What is it? It's our queen. Jayla. Jayla! Well, she broke up with Nicholas Holt. They broke oh, up. Oh, that's right. I don't believe him, though, when he's talking about the reason she they changed broke up because whatever, she changed right? and she got like a giant head or whatever. I don't know. Didn't she like smush Emma Watson's face? I'm pretty sure she seems the same. Right. I mean, she's yeah. still the same quirky girl mm -hmm. that I fell in love with. We will know. know. Yeah. So I don't believe that. And the reason I don't mm -hmm. is because I have not met her, so it's not a first hand experience. That is very true. I've not met her yet. Yeah. Hi, Jayla. Hi. It'd be awesome to meet you. Yeah, it would be. I'm still kind of mad that we missed Memory Heart. Oh, uh, I'm so irritated that we missed Hey USA. Um, they came to Sedona. It was Memory and Grace. Ugh, and they were so in Sedona. Unfair. And I didn't so know unfair. that they were coming until I saw the blooper reel that they posted. Ugh. But it was super cute to watch that girl meet them. It was so adorable. She's like, can I get a photo? And they took a selfie and cool. I'd love to take a selfie with Jayla. Jayla. Yeah, that would be epic. So um, what's your favorite thing Jayla's done? I like, I really like her as Mystique. Okay. Because, and the reason I say that is because I never thought that anybody could do Mystique justice like Rebecca Romaine did. Right. Until she came along. I think she's the perfect casting for it. And she was very good in... Um, Days of Future Past. Yes. She, as that mystique. As a kind of the her Raven. Vindictive. Right. Yeah. My favorite role she was in was in American Hustle. I just mm. loved her as that character. That's me. I thought that was yeah. so well done and it was hilarious. Her accent, I swear to God. Yeah, she was good. She played crazy perfect. Yeah. And it was good to see her in like um, a comedic role like that. Like, you know, the Silver Linings Playbook, she kind of had comedic. a comedic role, yeah. but it was overall dark, super dark. Yeah, so pretty dark. And I, to be honest, I kind of didn't like her acting in that. She was in, she's was. she been in a level, a couple other movies. I think the end of the street. Like, she's been in a bunch oh, of horror right. films. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, she doesn't do a lot of comedy, which I is weird to me. I think she should totally branch out. Yeah. J-Law, well, branch yeah, out. She's, like, fantastic at comedy. She's yeah. good delivery. Like, we've all seen her on uh, Jimmy Fallon. We have to do yeah, that. she's got great that comedic boxing. delivery. That <laughs> boxing. I so. like the the one where she was on Jimmy, I think it was Jimmy Fallon, and she was talking about how she was trying to dance with J-Lo. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and that's why and he's had, like, that's why there was beef between her and yeah. Jimmy Fallon, apparently, <laughs> is because he ditched her when they were <laughs> trying to go dance yeah, with J-Lo. Yeah, trying to dance with J-Lo. <laughs> it's just so much fun to like watch her in interviews, yeah. too, because she's and quirky. Not, and and kind of like, just doesn't give a shit. Like, no. kind of just doesn't give a she shit. She doesn't care. But like, four months ago, you think I'd be able to remember. Sorry, that was my phone. I have an email. Hmm. I'll get to it later. We're filming. Um, you guys are more important than that email. Oh, isn't he sweet? Um, <laughs> she doesn't really have anything else exciting going on, does she? I don't think so. How do you guys feel about Jennifer Lawrence? Yeah, tell us your thoughts. What are your feelings? And let's, feeling about what I you think feel? everyone should just tweet at her to watch our show because we said so. Yes. Tweet her with this video link. Mm-hmm. Because we're below. going to. Oh yeah, you multiple best believe. Times. You best believe I'm gonna say, oh, throwback Thursday <laughs> to that time we talked about J Law. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Yeah, um, can we talk about the fact that there's a new Bravo yeah. franchise for the Housewives? The Real Housewives of Melbourne, Australia. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't even handle these ladies. They're so ridiculous. I love them. Especially Gina. Gina is a barrister and she deals in the truth. Oh my god, I can't handle her. There's a girl who's on there who's a psychic, and Gina and her get into a fight. Oh my god, I can't. She's, sure, yeah, all telling the truth. Because she's a barrister, so. Which is basically, it's, it's, like, it's like we have lawyers here. Lawyers do everything. A barrister is the type of person that will file paperwork and stuff like that, but they don't actually do any of the litigation. I don't <laughs> look it up. Yeah, I've never. I had to look that. up what a I barrister. I just thought that was like a family name or something. No, but the barrister can do the same stuff that a lawyer does. It's just that normally those roles are separated. And, and it's super expensive to live in Australia, and everyone there makes a good billion dollars. Oh my god! Like seriously, the, just the properties that they have there are so out of expensive. Control. Out of control. This lady has five nannies. 
but she's got like five children and a business and her husband has a business and she keeps up with all of it. I can't believe humans have gotten to that, yeah. that place. I mean, that's how we are. I mean, that's what we do now. We watch reality television. Uh, it's that or big, it's that or Big Brother and Survivor. Like I wanted to like mind meld them, like just stick my fingers in their head. Look it up, mind meld Star mind Trek. Meld Star Trek. Um, no. So we're gonna do some song binges for you. Are you ready? Am I gonna go first? Is that what's happening? What's going on? Yeah, go first. Oh, I'm going first. Okay. So my song is, I think it's the new single from this art, fantastic artist named Jessie Ware. We've actually posted uh, one of her videos on our Tunes Day on Facebook. The song is called Tough Love. Mm. But anyways, I do like that song. I do like Tough Love by mm -hmm. Jessie Ware. Yeah, she's a, her voice is very lovely in it. Well, I mean, she's a good voice in general. I mean, she's but, it's real silky. Yeah, it's super silky in that song. And, um... It's kind of like a, almost like an R&B jam, kind of, but better. Perfect. But better. Right up my alley. Mm -hmm. But it's better. But it is better. So please click on the bitch jar for that. Jesse Ware, Tough mm -hmm. Love. Uh-huh. And her new album comes out soon, too, by the way. It's called, it's going to be called Tough Love, so check Ooh, even out. better. Mm -hmm. um, all right, so my song binge goes out to um, a... I want you to do it in that accent the entire time. My song binge goes out to main named Owen Pellet. Pellet? Pellet. Pellet. Mm hmm. Okay. It's hard to do that in this accent. <laughs> but you, Owen Pellet. You do it real well. Thank you. It has a, he has a song called The Riverbed off of his album In Conflict. And I'm conveniently going to go see him here when he comes. Okay, so, you can stop now. <laughs> it's a little, it just looks really weird. So, um, uh, I've been obsessed with the song lately. It's in my, it's in my CD player right now because I'm rocking the CD player still. That's why it's a song. <laughs> yeah, and I keep playing it over and over. I mean, it's like click here for Owen Palette. Yeah, 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 yeah. So those are our song binges. Mhm. Mm All right. So thank you guys so much for watching. Mm -hmm. As always. Love you, booze. As always, thank you so much, you unicorns. Ah, unis. Unicorns. Oh, unis. So as always, like, comment, subscribe, share the video with your friends. The subscribe button is right up here. It's a rainbow. Follow us on FB. Follow us on Facebook. Follow Catch us our on daily Twitter. posts. Get our daily posts on the Facebook. Uh, super funness. Yeah. It's a different thing every day. Yes, it is. So we're and we're quite original. So. We're coming at you. Oh. Coming from every you. side. Coming at you. So, I mean, I guess okay. without further. Adieu. Adieu. Okay, bye. Bye.